For my book recommendation, I'm going to go with The Spider White Chronicles by Tony Ditterlizzi and Holly Black. Uh, the version I'm holding right now is the Complete Fantastical Edition, which puts all five books in the series into one. But if you could find them on their own separate, uh, The Field Guide, uh, The Seeing Stone, Lucinda's Secret, The Ironwood Tree, and The Wrath of Malgrath, I highly recommend those too, whatever works. Um, it's a story about three siblings who end up finding this gateway to a magical and mystical world of different like fairy tale like creatures and then it turns into a save the world sort of situation as you get from books one to four uh, with more creatures and characters and crazy things happening uh, one of the main reasons that i was drawn to this when i was in elementary school was because of the drawings um, i have one at a couple like there's the ones that are in the book like in the book normally just during random pages that look really good but then the part that always stuck with me even years later when I haven't read this for a while is at the end they show every uh, like kind of like every creature that they discuss but then they show multiple drawings and different ideas uh, this is for the character Malgrath who is the main villain so you see a few drawings of that creature and then like the hideouts and stuff and it could I could do I could sit here for 10 minutes just talking about how good all these drawings are but yeah just stuff like this is what drew me to it and I imagine would draw plenty of kids to it because I know when I was younger my whole class loved these books because my teacher had them individually and then that's what led me to get this so I highly recommend the spider white chronicles for elementary kids middle school kids or anyone uh, all ages would love this uh, magical and fantastical journey Thank you.